Posted in this week's reading material is an excerpt from Johnson's Computer Ethics. It describes how we practice ethics by differentiating descriptive claims from normative claims. It is important for all of us in this world to see issues without bias. Examining topics objectively and without prejudice is an important skill for all of us. We need to describe the world and events around us with impartiality. A descriptive accounting of an event is empirical, describing facts only. A descriptive claim is impartial. But it is also important to recognize that we all see the world through our own lens. Our personal lens can create bias. A normative claim provides an accounting which our personal bias or how we think the world should operate is included. Normative claims include how a person is expected to behave based upon our worldly perspective. As an example, suppose we are describing an event involving a person's driving. A descriptive accounting might state a person was driving at a speed of 50 miles an hour in an area where the speed limit is 15 miles per hour. On the other hand, a normative statement might describe that a person drove recklessly, endangering the lives of countless individuals. Note the bias and judgment in the terms of reckless and endangerment of lives. Normative claims include some expectation as to how a person should behave. The study of ethics is normative. It is prescriptive and evaluative. But prior to making normative claims, it is critical we see the empirical aspects of all issues first. We are a pluralistic society. In other words, not everyone sees the world through the same lens. When practicing ethics, always begin by analyzing the empirical facts and events first.